my great great grand uncle and my great great grand auntie. Good morning. How are you? <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Got the scarf on, got the jacket on. <laughs> it's quite alright. Yeah. Yeah, don't need to talk to me because the language is what we make out of in our, in our own mind with our understanding of life. And a wise man like yourself, made out of a trunk, a tree, still life. And uh, goosebumps. <laughs> Thank you, sir. It's very very uh, gentle of your patience for being here uh, patiently dressed so yet uh, making us feel uh, very unusual I would say because the way we have brought ourselves with information and gathering of information We've lost our way and we don't communicate anymore in the sense of conscious sense of ways. And uh, it is a sad prospect that this is a, this is a case. And how is the missus, by the way? And uh, is the missus all right? Is that okay if I go and say hello to her as well and find out about... Uh, Oh, look at the insects on the foray, just like it would fly onto you. Yeah. Well, it's uh, nice uh, crossing your path, and uh, see you another time. Good morning. How you been? Um, I hope uh, all been well. Um, and uh, I'm just uh, passing through here. And since six o'clock and nobody's awake. I don't know if it's, um, this is so early or it's just always been like this. Anyway, uh, your patience is much appreciated and entertaining us here. Yeah.